Hello, I'm Lucy. I'm an Open Table trustee. So Christmas is over. No, it isn't. Christmas Day is over. And actually, Christmas is never over. Jesus has had his birth and his birthday, but now he will begin to grow up into the most significant person in the world. The truths of Christmas go on and on. They just get bigger and more grown up from this point. Mary's waters break and out of muddle, inconvenience and pain comes astonishing beauty. From one minute to the next, things move from really pretty, ordinary and squalid to sparkling and touching. And the first to be invited to their God aren't princes and priests. They're powerless people who've been given a bad name. They're riffraff shepherds down from the hills. What's God doing here? God's doing equality, bringing the despised and the marginalised right inside. Wow. And a few weeks later, more unexpected visitors are made welcome. The Magi. Now, you probably know all about this, but the wise men are magicians, foreigners from far away of different cultures, faiths, colours, routines, bringing their gifts. Well, what's God doing now? Well, showing wealth bowing down to poverty, yes. And showing power bowing down to weakness, yes. And magic bowing down to miracle, well, of course. But God's doing equality again. God has drawn in and welcomed people from outside the fold again. God is breaking the clique. The Christmas visitors to Jesus are our plain diagram of everyone's utter belonging, whoever we are, whatever we are, on equal terms and joyfully. It's the time where all our gifts are appreciated and accepted. Wow. The Open Table Network aches for all LGBTQIA plus people to receive this epiphany, that the Jesus story isn't just about you believing in God, but about God believing in you. I know money is tight, but please give what money you can to help us extend that glorious, equal welcome. It's a present we really need. Thank you.